Championship rival in second. Callum Eilot in the top three for the third time in 2019. He is next to Luca Giotto. The toe that's important here. Here's a battle between the teammates. Different compounds. Medium tyres for Giotto. Super soft tyres now for Guan Yu Zhou. And the driver who's finished on the podium four times this season is alongside. And is he going to be able to outbreak his teammate? No, he's not. Schumacher defence from Mass Pin behind. And Giotto hangs on for the moment. He's not on the right compound as it happens right now that could easily change in a few laps time his teammate trying to pass him on track wants to clear him uh, is he going to be able to do so we saw Delatraz getting very so wide number two. now this is Luca Giotto getting past and moving up to third place as the super soft compound begins to lose it and Schumacher as taking second place with those medium tyres Luca Giotto now he is in the box seat this is why he went the different way to everyone else he will easily eat up into the advantage of Nick to try the overtake, but just after these corners, there will be a long straight. There is left and then right and then long straight with the use of the DRS. Well, Giotto, you can try. Maybe earlier, maybe earlier, because he's trying now. And he's taking the lead. Luca Giotto on the medium tyres takes the lead from Nick De Vries. De Vries wasn't going to fight that one, and I don't think he could have done even if he wanted to. They will hope to rejoin battle later in the race. Well, Giotto will hope that his alternate strategy leads him miles. There's just more grip. Look also Giotto taking the leadership of the race just before the main straight. He just went on the inside, breaks the six tenths. And now Giotto in this lap, they need to pit him. <laughs> I think they need to pit him. It's the right time because look, just behind him, Matsushita seems that. Also him with the, on the alternative strategy is just... Trying to reduce the wheel spin out of the corners. And now it's over to the team. Into the pits comes Luca Giotto for a pit stop that could well decide the race and continue the battle in the Drivers' Championship. He is going to cut the beam. Virtuosi to receive him. Super soft song. And he gets away. No repeat of Monza. So, back to the driver. The team have done the job. Now, the between the end is how long is it going to take Luca Giotto to warm up those tyres? And when he's done so, can they keep the Italian behind? Come on, Giotto! But tell me, Deletrace was on the alternative strategy or no? Because uh, it's just been a surprise to me. Deletrace, uh, we miss him during the race, and now he's third at the moment. Third! He's on the podium position. Yeah, he did what? De Vries and the team at the very end of the race. Very important to Deletrace try to defend the position right now. Now, immediately, he needs to cover the first attack of Giotto. Like this, he put Giotto under pressure, he can destroy his tyres. Oh, he's right! Is Giotto going to risk it? No, he decides against him, but he might be able to come back with superior traction. Good defence from Louis Delatraz, but remember what Delatraz did earlier in the race. Just so much more traction, and he's going to have the inside line. This will be yeah. third position for Luca Giotto. The race is not done yet. On to the podium, the driver who tried the alternate strategy. But we're on to the penultimate lap of the race. It's not easy at all, but Delatraz, he opened it a bit too much, the line and the traction. And this was the moment where he was able to get third place, and that was a super, super move with the tyres. All of the, the tires, Giotto, it will be not easy for him to try to overtake Latifi. Seems close enough, but the traction and the advantage traction that he has at the beginning seems a bit lost. Probably he's he in advance. Oh, look, Delatraz for the podium position. Delatraz coming back. The tires have wow. gone off the cliff as they go past. Is he going to come back? Yes, he is. The tires have gone off the cliff. That's why they didn't allow him that many times. Delatraz takes him back. Giotto locks up Ooh. and he's got him. What a mega move from last year. And they have taken Nick Freeze to the next to the Freeze for the title this year. This was Delatraz not giving up and getting past. Another driver not giving up was Luca Giotto, just about slowing it down for the 13th corner. Luca Delatraz was on the outside, but then inside this is corner, and there was a stream to close the line. He was brave. Eh? What a race for Delatraz! That he just surprised me. I'm sorry because I didn't take a look to Delatraz race, but at the end, if this came back was just perfect. A very good.